and at Dell before, that's been in the news, and at libraries and at London train stations, as we've shown, and EU train stations. They have computer filter programs for the public's, quote, safety that stop five categories that are high risk. Gambling, hacking, porn, crime, and hate. And now they're adding other categories, uh, illegal shop, file swapping, you know, piracy. So I guess there's six. There was five when I first learned of this, like, 15, 16 years ago, we were getting censored at first and getting the documents. People were you know, shooting video of the library saying this is you know, Infowars.com. You're not allowed to go there. It's a hate site. And so we threatened some of the companies that were putting us in there and they backed off. But smaller sites don't know how to do that. They, they stay banned. So that's all this is, is they have a database and they basically say, don't do this. And look, the newspapers for more than a decade, almost all of them will not take a gun shop advertising. Most of them will not take um, classified ads for guns. Craigslist has stopped doing it. Uh, this is how, outside of the law, through the establishment, they're doing this. And this is what the Nazis did. In 1933, they started having big banks refuse Jews' bank accounts. Then they stopped refusing them to have money transfers. Uh, wires, they had those back then on Telegraph. Then they started not letting them have shipments on trains. And they started not letting them have their businesses open, started knocking the windows out, crystal night and things like that. And you can go, oh, whatever, you know, what's with the Nazi analogy? Well, I mean, internal checkpoints, black uniforms, armored vehicles, German shepherds. I mean, this is it. This is it, internal checkpoints. And while they've got us busy thinking racism's under every table and, and, and bringing in anti-free movements and new FCC Gestapo's, they're going to go out and inspect every newsroom in the country to make sure you're not racist. It's a witch hunt, folks. It's political, Soviet-style persecution. And this is a crystal knot against gun owners and against gun shops. And the gun owners and gun shops are isolated. They're alone. They don't recognize historically what's happening to them. I'm giving you the context right now. So, it's just like sanctions on Iran or something, or sanctions on Russia. These are illegal, color of law, racketeering, fraudulent, these words mean something. And uh, Criminal, mafia, racketeering, outside of the law, color of law, sanctions against gun owners. See, what do they call the new free press in 1993, four, five, in that White House memo that's now been released uh, 30 pages, but Joseph Farah got the whole thing out of the Clinton Library. That's coming out soon. It's so bombshell, he doesn't know what to even do with it. It's so big. The Western Journalism Center. They said, we got to stop new media getting money and cut off their commerce. We got to demonize any new media as conspiracy theorists, have our media do that to shut down the public having venues to be able to communicate. They had just lost control of talk radio a few years before. So we're actually in a revolution against them. We're actually gaining ground. When you launch a YouTube site, when you launch a website, when you repost our information, when you ha hand out flyers of the show, when you start your own local radio show, your own access show, or sponsor somebody who you hear on the radio to, to have more time, you are absolutely in a war. And all you got to do in the war, I'll, I'll use the moose hunting analogy. Up in Michigan, up in upstate New York, up in other places where they've got some moose, I guess. Montana, you know, Utah, whatever. You've got to go to a lottery to be able... Here's an example. If you don't want to pay to alligator hunt in South Texas, where you can kill 15-foot alligators because they're overpopulated, eating people's dogs and stuff. you got to go do a lottery, and then one out of five, one out of ten, depends on the year of the county, you will get to go on public land, and you will get to hunt an alligator. Okay? And then get boots made out of it. We've done that. You know, my son, right of passage, he's killed three alligators. By hand. Shot him in the head. Himself. Over the boat. But the whole point is, is that... Let's say we had a physical war with the criminal government. There's 160, 70 million gun owners. Let's say 1% fight back, 1.6 million combatants. 
you'd have to go out and get a lottery for an establishment person to kill. You go out and kill one person, and I'm not saying do this, it's an analogy, it's over for them. You go out and kill one globalist or one minion of theirs, when you start that, they will panic and all run to Switzerland and we'll take the country. I don't want to go there, it's not going to happen. We're going to, we're going to fix this peacefully. But it's the same thing politically. You pop up and do political stuff, you pop up every week and do something, a banner hang, uh, hand out cards, go to city council, go lobby for pro-Second Amendment, pro-sovereignty, pro-liberty movements, whatever is, pick an issue. You go out and just do a little something every week, you will bring them to their knees. And they know that. And that's why they want to shut us down and shut everybody else down. Because if you engage in the info war, 90% of war is info war, I agree with the Pentagon, it's over. Folks, we've already got the military awake. The military is the most, a group, a most awake group out there. Over 80%. The globalists are in deep trouble. Now we're reaching out to the police. Let's face it, folks. Times, they are a-changing. Whether you're a hardcore survivalist or not, colloidal silver water and cream should be in everyone's medicine cabinet or bug-out bag. If the grid goes down, you'll still need to stop infections and kill germs. Colloidal silver water and cream does that. It's affordable and storable. Stock up today at colloidalresearch.com. It's made in America using only pure and natural ingredients. No preservatives or additives. Read all about it at colloidalresearch.com. Check it out. Colloidalresearch.com. How can you save a ton of money and prepare for emergencies? By having your own in-home freeze dryer from Harvest Right. Now you can cut down on wasted food by freeze drying your leftovers. That's right. Create your own long-term food storage by freeze drying your own fruits, meats, vegetables, even complete meals with the Harvest Right in-home freeze dryer. Imagine the savings and the peace of mind. See how the amazing Harvest Right freeze dryer works at HarvestRight.com. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. To have a fighting chance against cold and flu bugs, get the world's best garlic extract, Allison Plus C. Fight viruses, bacteria, and fungi with Allison Plus C. Scientifically proven in double-blind studies using low doses to greatly reduce the number, severity, and duration of common colds. Allison Plus C contains 300 milligrams of stabilized Allison, the active ingredient in crushed garlic. Studies show Allison Plus C is effective against MRSA, bacterial, fungal, and viral infections. One tablet of Allison Plus C has the equivalent of 40 cloves of garlic. Allison Plus C supports your body's resistance to all types of conditions and can help lower high blood pressure and high cholesterol. So boost your body's resistance to infection with nature's best garlic extract. Allison Plus C. To order, call 855-ALLISON. That's 855-255-4246. Or go to allisonplus.com. Spelled A-L-L-I-C-I-N plus.com. Get Allison Plus C from Affinity Health Products. When the levee breaks, I have no place to stay. Going down, going down now, down to Chicago. That's part. Here's what I'm getting at. If you let one ant stand up, they might all stand up, and then there goes our way of life. So the establishment's busy dividing us on religion, race, sex, using some old evil f f 
pot-bellied billionaire as a reason to create all this guilt and how do we prove we're not racist and blah, blah, blah politically to beat white people over the head into acquiescing to turn their guns in because Michael Moore says you're racist if you own a gun. Look it up. That's what he says every time he's on MSNBC. I tell you, it's just a bunch of old racist white people don't like guns. They, I mean, don't like black people. And so that's why they got guns. Really? I got a video right here on Infowars.com of a black man jumping out of his car in about two seconds, very professionally, and stopping two people that are mugging a woman and her family and putting the criminals down on the ground. And you're not going to see that image on the news except locally. We're going to play that in the next hour. Well, this is the type of stuff we're dealing with, ladies and gentlemen. And now we have to understand that if we just politically start doing stuff outside the box, let's say you call yourself a real liberal, cares about the environment, cares about freedom, but understands we've got a federal tyranny, go out and do the issues you think are important. But don't be part of some establishment group that siphons your energy off as AstroTurf to push their agenda as a rent -a mob do your own thing. Be an individual. Create art. Create your own original ideas. Go out and do street art in, in common areas where it's acceptable. They have that in a lot of cities and counter all the stupid gang culture graffiti with powerful political messages. Sometimes I feel the urge and, you know, climb on things in the middle of the night with spray paint. Oh, I'm just joking. The point is, is that You've got to put it into physical action, ladies and gentlemen. We've got to totally overwhelm the globalist. We've got to really get aggressive with them, or they're going to start a physical civil war in this country that is meant to destroy the police and military to bring in the next wave, as well as destroying the domestic resistance at the same time. And that's why we're pushing for nonviolent civil disobedience. But when they physically attack you for peaceful civil disobedience, it's going to the next level. I do not believe in offensive violence, but I do believe in defending yourself. And by the way, that's all Malcolm X ever said, and he's been demonized lately as being someone who called for violence. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. He called for defending yourself if you're attacked. And ladies and gentlemen, that's not terrorism. If the feds at the Bundy Ranch would have shot those citizens, most of them unarmed, it would have been an act of government tyranny, an act of government terrorism, and a new 1776 would have started. I, I do not want that to happen. Every bone in my body is against it. This hour, don't forget, was brought to you by MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex. High quality non-GMO foods and other key uh, survival implements, 866-229-099. To seven, mypatriotsupply.com forward slash Alex. And you can also support us and get 11 memberships for the price of one at prisonplanet.tv. See all my films in HD, the nightly news, and so much more at prisonplanet.tv and fund the very tip of the spear of the info war. And don't forget, we also have InfoWarsStore.com with the t-shirts, the books, the films, the nascent iodine, the incredible supplements, and you're funding the tip of the spear, prisonplanet.tv, InfoWars.com. Second to hour coming up. Stay with us on this Visit Thursday GMI Global Transmission. Alex Jones here with a very important announcement. A lot of you asked me to come speak in your town or city. I would love to, but I'm so busy here in the trenches at the InfoWars Command Center, I'm just unable to travel. When my friends at Stansbury Research, one of the top analyst firms in the world, invited me to be part of a special one-day event in Dallas, Texas, I could not say no. You will hear from true experts like Porter Stansbury, T. Boone Pickens, Cactus Schroeder, Bill Murphy, Van Simmons, and myself, Alex Jones. I will be speaking on the fact that history is happening now. We are now at a critical juncture where more happens in a month than happened in the previous 10 years. I will also be breaking down the fact that a moral society is the only truly prosperous and safe society. May 31st, it's one day the tickets will sell out. Simply visit alexjonesdallas.com or follow the banners at infowars.com. I have secured a discount for my listeners when you visit alexjonesdallas.com. Again, that's alexjonesdallas.com to secure your tickets for this one-time event, and I'll see you in Dallas.